Aloha children! Once again, welcome to our online learning journey in Mathematics 5. In this video children, we're going to learn about addition and subtraction of decimal numbers through thousands with or without regrouping. Let us begin our online discussion by reading the story problem, and it goes like this. A butcher weighed two hogs. One hog weighed 35 and 4,500 kilograms, while the other weighed 41 and 7,500 kilograms. What is the total weight of the two hogs? Let us answer the following questions based on our story problem. The first question is, what is asked in the problem? And the answer is, what is the total weight of the two hogs? The second question in the story problem is, what are the given in the story problem? The given are, 35 and 4,500 kilograms and 41 and 7,500 kilograms are the weights of the two hogs respectively. The third question is, what is the clue or keyword or words in the problem? And the answer is total. To solve this story problem, we need to add 35 and 4500 kilograms and 41 and 7500 kilograms. Adding decimals are similar as to adding whole numbers. To add decimals, let us follow these steps. Step 1. Write the decimals in column or according to its place value with the decimal points lined up, like this one. Step 2. Put zeros, if necessary, at the right of the decimal point to make the number of decimal places the same. In our given example, there is no need for us to add zeros, so let's proceed to step 3. Step 3 is add the numbers as you would add the whole numbers, then copy the decimal point in the answer. So let us add 35 and 45 hundredths and 41 and 75 hundredths. So we will get the answer of 77 and 20 hundredths. So the total weight of the two hogs is 77 and 20 hundredths kilograms. Let us have another story problem, and it goes like this. A farmer has an orchard measuring 0 and 82 hundredths hectare. If 0 and 543 thousandths hectare is planted to mangoes and the rest to avocados, what part is planted to avocados? Let us answer the following questions based on our story problem. The first question is, what is asked in the problem? And the answer is, what part is planted to avocados? The second question in the story problem is, what are the given in the story problem? And the answer, 0 and 82 hundredths hectare, the measurement of the farmer's orchard, and 0 and 543 thousandths hectare planted to mangoes. The third question is, what is the clue or keyword or words in the problem? And the answer is, rest. To solve this story problem, we need to subtract 0 and 543 thousandths hectare from 0 and 82 hundredths hectare. Subtracting decimals are similar as to subtracting whole numbers. To subtract decimals, let us follow these steps. Step 1. Write the decimals in column or according to its place value with the decimal points lined up, like this one. 
Step 2. Put zeros if necessary at the right of the decimal point to make the number of decimal places the same. In our example, we need to put 0 besides 2 to make the number of decimal places the same. After which, we will proceed to step 3. Step 3 is to subtract the numbers as you would subtract the whole numbers. Then, copy the decimal point in the answer. So we will subtract 0 and 543 thousands from 0 and 820 thousands. So we will get the answer of 0 and 277 thousands. And the area planted to avocados is 0 and 277 thousands hectares. All right, children, let us apply what you have learned earlier by answering the practice exercise. Direction. Write the following in column, then add. You will be given 30 seconds to answer each number. Are you ready now? Let's proceed. Number 1. 9 and 46 hundredths plus 5 and 9 hundredths is equal to N. Go! And the correct answer is 14 and 55 hundredths. Number 2. 3 and 82 hundredths plus 4 and 75 hundredths is equal to N. Go! And the correct answer is 8 and 57 hundredths. Number 3. 12 and 463 thousandths plus 15 and 9 tenths is equal to N. Go! And the correct answer is... 28 and 363 thousandths. Number 4, 2 and 349 thousandths plus 1 and 2 tenths plus 3 and 4 hundredths is equal to N. Go! And the correct answer is... 6 and 589 thousandths. Direction. Write the following in column, then subtract. Again, you are given 30 seconds to answer each number. Are you ready now? Let's proceed. Number 1. 79 and 52 hundredths minus 23 and 4 tenths is equal to N. Go. And the correct answer is 56 and 12 hundredths. Number 2. 18 and 678 thousandths minus 7 and 942 thousandths is equal to N. Go! And the correct answer is... 10 and 736 thousandths. Number 3. 25 and 63 hundredths minus 12 and 9 tenths is equal to N. Go! And 
And the correct answer is 12 and 73 hundredths. Number 4. 6 and 350 thousandths minus 2 and 140 thousandths is equal to N. Go! And the correct answer is 4 and 21 hundredths. Keep this in mind, children. To add or subtract decimal numbers, follow these steps. Step 1. Write the numbers in column. Align the decimal points. Step 2. Put zeros, if necessary, at the right of the decimal points to make the number of decimal places the same. Step 3. Add or subtract decimals as whole numbers. Then, write the decimal point in the sum or difference which is aligned with the other decimal points. That's all for now, children. See you soon in our next online learning journey. Thank you for watching and please don't forget to hit like and subscribe to my YouTube channel.